Hi, this is a video about connecting your SQ to a door, specifically to Repo. First thing you need to do is go to the Alan Heath website, the SQ page, and then go to the software tab. You'll find the door controller here for PC and Mac. As you can see, it's not a very large file, and this, once installed, will live in your toolbar. The next thing you need to do is go back to our SQ, go to the Utility button, and then go to the General and MIDI tab. We choose our MIDI channel here, and you'll notice the door control channel is always one channel up. The next thing we need to do is go to the Setup button, the Surface tab, and then we choose DCA and MIDI. Choose a layer that we want to stick our MIDI layers onto, and then we just pull them down onto the surface. Next thing we need to do is set up our door control driver. We set up the mixer while right we're on an SQ. The MIDI channel, remember, one up from the console, so number two. Our protocol, I'm choosing Huey. And then our MIDI in and out ports. Then we go into preferences and MIDI devices and we enable the MIDI in. We also enable our input for control messages. On our outputs, we then find our SQ again, and we enable the outputs of this device. next thing we need to do is set up the control driver in Reaper, go to Preferences and the Control OSC tab. We can now add our door control. The way to do that is go to the Add tab and we choose our Huey and our MIDI input. Now the MIDI is split into four parts and controls eight channels each. So for 32 channels, we've got four door control. We add MIDI one, as you can see, I've already done one here. But the thing to bear in mind is that, as I said, eight channels each. So when we go to MIDI control two, make sure the surface offset is on nine, so that it controls channels nine to 16. And on MIDI three, it's 17, etc. Your channel strip will then reflect what is on your door and will be labelled as such and you will have control over your surface. Likewise, when I control the surface, it will control what's happening on the door. The PAPL button is a solo button. We have mutes for individual channels. And we also have select, so we can select channels on your door. I hope this video has been of use, and uh, don't forget to check out Alan Heath's videos and webinars on SQ, DLive and Avantis.